course presentation enables you to author and deliver your course materials directly in your browser. It is used when you want to package a piece of learning content in a structured and interactive format. Learners swipe through slides to experience the learning material while solving various quizzes or watching videos along the way. So, first you need to click the Add an Activity or Resources button and then select Interactive Content button. Click the Add button. You will be directed to adding a new interactive content window. You may insert a description of your interactive content to let the students know what are they going to explore or do. Next, scroll down until you see the editor panel. Here, you can see a list of content types that can be used. Scroll down and select course presentation by clicking on it. It will show you the screen setup. Insert the title for the slide first, like this, for example, Cloud Varies. Click the slides drop down arrow and tick Always Show to indicate user at which slide they are in. Write your slide title here for the first slide. To add image, click this image button. And click the plus add button. Select your picture and insert the alternative tag so that if the browser cannot load the image, the tags will appear. Click the Edit Copyright under the image to fill up the license information of the image. For example, like this. Then, click Done. You may drag the image and adjust the size to your preferred location. To add another picture, repeat the same process like previous steps. To add text, you can just click the text tool and insert the text that you want it to appear using the toolbar. Then, press done. To add new slide, you can click this Add New Slide icon at the bottom of the slide. Now, if you want to add link to it, you need to click the Link icon button. Then, Insert the title that you want it to be displayed in the slide. For instance, find the recipe here. Next, insert the URL link and click the Done button. The link will appear in blue color on the slide. User can click the link and it will direct you to the site. Now, we will learn on how to create summary that allows the learners to make an interactive summary of the previous slides they have learned. Click the Summary button. Insert the title and provide your introduction text like Choose the correct statement. To build a summary, you need to have a set of statements for a learner to choose. You need to make sure the correct answer is placed at the first base of the list of statements. Then, if you want to create more statements, you can click this capital letter Add Statement button and create another statement and answer. Click this Done button after finish. Then, drag and adjust the position. After finish with the screen setup slide, you can edit other settings for the e-learning. Then, you can click Save and Display button and it will direct you to your slide. You can see how it works and edit it again if there is any error or mistakes.